Hey guys, my name is Dakota Russell with Bergara. Today I'm going to share with you some of our brand new rifles that we've got here at SHOT Show this year. The first one we have is actually one of our premier series rifles. This is the MG Microlite. So the MG Microlite has actually got magnesium chassis here, so it's lighter weight than aluminum. But we're still able to add all the same features you would find in a machined aluminum chassis. So we've got M-Lock here, rails on the sides, both left and right, and on the bottom. So you can add a pick rail to this if you'd like. We also have integrated Arca Swiss rail on the fore end of the chassis here. As we work our way to the back of the chassis, we've actually got a bubble level built in. So the bubble level is obviously going to help you get a lot more, uh, a lot more stabilized on your shot. Make sure you're level for those long distance shots. Carbon fiber all over this chassis as well. Carbon fiber buttstock, carbon fiber grip, and our Cure carbon fiber barrel. So the buttstock, you'll actually notice there's a button here. We've got a folding adapter on it. So you can actually fold this stock down makes for an ultra compact package. You can actually put this rifle on your back, 18 inch barrel on this rifle, so you can run a suppressor on it, put it on your backpack. You don't ever have to worry about busting through brush and getting stuck and getting pulled on your back like you've, you've probably done before. So carbon fiber grip, it's an ultra, ultra lightweight carbon fiber grip, but as with carbon fiber on, on other models and other, uh, other accessories on them, it's ultra strong, very, very strong grip. We've actually cut slots in this grip just to reduce the weight that much more. And speaking of weight, this rifle's coming in at 5.8 pounds. Short action cartridges are 6.5 Creedmoor, 6.5 PRC, and 308. Built on our Premier Series Action. So all Premier Series Actions have a 416 stainless material on them. Same with our barrels. Um, obviously it's a carbon, carbon fiber wrap, so the interior of this is actually a steel um, 416 stainless um, barrel there. So Trigger Tech Triggers. So Trigger Tech Triggers are, are a highly renowned trigger. Externally adjustable, so you don't need a gunsmith to adjust the trigger pull weight on this. The trigger pull weight will go from about a pound and a half up to about three pounds. You just use an Allen key, go straight through the trigger guard, and it's got positive clicks. So you can actually hear and feel the clicks. Each click up or down is about two ounces in weight adjustment. Rifles coming in retail at $29.99. Moving to the next model here, this, the rest of the models are going to be our B14 series rifles. So this is our B14 Crest Carbon. So it's a Crest stock. We actually manufacture these stocks ourselves over in Spain where all of our B14 rifles are made. Vertical grip, got a little palm swell to it, fills that palm up. Very, very comfortable stock. Feels like a, a high quality custom rifle as soon as you pick it up. Smooth, beautiful carbon fiber finish on it. We've got flush cups in the front and rear on both sides of the stock. We've also got two swivel, uh, swivel studs up front. So having the two swivel studs, you can actually remove these, put an Arca Swiss rail on here, Salmon River style Arca Swiss with a pick rail on it as well, or you can run just a pick rail. Obviously you can run a Harris style bipod and a sling as well on it. You'll notice it's got a carbon fiber barrel. So it's a Cure carbon fiber barrel. It's got a muzzle brake on it as well. 5 8 24 uh, muzzle threads. These come in short and long action cartridges, so the short actions are 20 inch barrel, longs are a 22 inch barrel. We've got our spiral fluted bolt body on here and a B14 action. So the B14 action takes all Remington 700 bases, uh, 648 screws. We've got our Bergara trigger and it. it's a Bergara performance trigger. So the Bergara performance triggers are somewhat similar to a trigger tech. They don't have the same sealed roller bearing sears in them, but they do have the externally adjustable trigger pull weight. Same way you would access a trigger tech. Go straight through the trigger guard. You've got an Allen screw right here. You can adjust it up or down. You start at about two pounds on this trigger and you can go up to about three and a half pounds. Um, this is gonna be offered in a, lar a large variety of calibers, to be honest with you, um, short action and long action. Obviously, we've got the PRCs in there, 6.5 and 7 PRC, and all of your standard cartridges as well. Rifle's coming in at 6.2 pounds. Retail on this rifle is $19.99. Moving down to the next one, it looks like a, a very basic rifle, but it's one that I'm super excited about. It's our very first compact rifle in the B14 line. So we've got a 12 and a half or 12 and a quarter inch length of pull actually, but we've actually shipped three quarter inch length of pull spacers in the stock or in the box with this rifle. Gets you up there to 13 inch length of pull. So users, if it's if it's kids, um, they can actually grow with the rifle as well or women, they can just fine tune that adjustment. They can either shoot it like this, add one, two, three spacers if they would like. We've actually designed this stock 
from the ground up. So it's not that we took a traditional stock that we have in our line and just cut the, uh, the length of pull down on it. We actually redesigned the rifle uh, completely from the ground up, like I said. So this stock's actually narrowed up a bit on the front. We narrowed the grip up for smaller palms. We did, however, add a little bit more of a vertical grip to it. So semi-vertical grip um, really adds to that comfort and precision shooting. Based off of our B14 action, so just like the rest of the B14s, takes Remington 700 bases with 648 screws. It comes in short action cartridges and it comes in a large variety of them as well. From 223, which has a 16 and a half inch barrel, 350 Legend, 300 Blackout. And then we move up to your other cartridges like 22, 250, 243, 65 Creedmoor. We have 308, 65 PRC and a few others as well. They'll all have a 20 inch barrel. It does have a four and a half contour barrel, so it does still have a, a lighter weight package. The rifle starts at six pounds, but we are still able to have a little bit of meat on this barrel, enough to thread at 5 8 24. So you can add a muzzle brake or you could add a suppressor. Rifles, like I said, coming in at six pounds, so it's really lightweight, uh, but not too light. So if somebody, that, you know, a smaller structure, we don't really want to have them shooting a 6.5 PRC and the rifle weigh four and a half pounds and rock their world. Um, we're super excited about this one. We've never really had an offering for, you know, smaller size shooters. It's a very compact package, shorten the fore end down. It's got a really fine balance to it. And the rifle's coming in at $7.99 retail. Moving to the last one that's new for this year, this is a B14 Wilderness Sierra. So the Wilderness Sierra is really kind of a combination of a lot of features found in a lot of our different platforms. We've got an adjustable cheek rise on this, so you just access that adjustment right here with the Allen key. You can adjust that up or down to fine tune your adjustment to your optics height. It actually does come with length of pull spacers as well. So it is a standard size length of pull stock, but you can add spacers to it to, to fine tune that adjustment. So if you're 6'6", the rifle's still gonna fit you. You'll notice it still has that semi-vertical grip, um, which is kind of similar to more precision type rifles but not quite as vertical as uh, some other competition style rifles. The reason that we've incorporated that into the previous model, which is the Stoke and the Sierra, is to really fine tune kind of the shootability of the platform overall. So you can actually grip that rifle here, lay your thumb up top, not wrap it around on top of this stock and add that torque. So a little bit of palm swell in this, fill that palm a little bit more, add to that comfort. It does have an M5 cutout here. So M5 bottom metal, it comes with a floor plate but you can actually convert this over to a DBM if you'd like. So this is in our Wilderness series. So it's got that spiral fluted bolt body based off of the B14 action. So it's got, you know, it'll accept any Remington 700 bases, 648 screws, short action cartridges. It's gonna have a 20 inch barrel. Longs, it'll have a 22 inch barrel. We've added some deep flutes to this, which has helped us to reduce that weight. So the overall weight on this rifle starting at 7.4 pounds, which for those of you that are familiar with our B14 Ridge model, it's probably one of our most popular models. It's the exact same weight. So we've actually added some features to the rifle, but didn't have to add to the weight of the rifle when looking at some of the other models. It does have an omnidirectional muzzle brake on it, and it's gonna be threaded 5.8 to 24, so you can take that muzzle brake off and add your favorite suppressor to the rifle. Like I said, on some of the other ones, it comes in all the hottest cartridges in the market today. Rifle starting at 7.4 pounds, and the retail on this one's gonna be 9.99. So the Wilderness Sierra is actually gonna be offered in left hand. So we've previously offered the HMR in left hand, which is about nine and a half pounds. So now we've actually got a hunting rifle in the line. It's just under seven and a half pounds, offered in a variety of left-handed uh, options in different calibers. So we're super excited to finally have a platform that is really designed for hunters that are left-handed.